This next story is trending in South Carolina this morning. We're talking about microchipping, and that's because a University of South Carolina student, Evan Breyer, he's a first year computer science student, implanted several microchips to his hand. So he's never going to lose his student ID ever again or not get access to a building, apparently. So what he did was he took the information from his Carolina card, which is their student ID, imported personal information and passwords, and bought these microchips, and he implanted them into his hand right between his index finger and his thumb right there. He described the pain as a little bit intense, like a flu shot, you could say. Did it himself and did it before telling his parents in his own apartment there on campus or near the campus, I should say. So this student said it cost him about $120 to $150. The Carolina card, that information on the microchip was 60. A microchip with passwords was 40. And then he also got one with an LED light kit so that when he brought it up, he could see where it was at and that costed him about $30. We've seen microchips really get a lot of attention here in conversation regarding them and our animals and obviously now in people. A lot of different businesses, there's a Swedish company, a U.S. software company in the last couple years that have gotten on board giving access to buildings, even using them to pay at vending machines, passwords as you see here. And now turning to sinks, this is going to be new. They're testing it right now on doctors and nurses and they're saying that the microchip for washing their hands could be better than just like the sensor of a sink. Let us know what you think about this. Use the hashtag wake up CLT. Do you think it's convenient? Do you think it's creepy? I, I'm not doing it, guys. I'm scared. Before, I'm all for it. I'm not going to do it myself. Right. I'm not going to buy no. a kit and yeah, there's no way. I'm just scared about the long term side effects that we have no idea about yet. Well, that's true well, for so much. I was just going to say, you can say that for so many <laughs> so things. So many things. But like in your body? I know. Yeah, very it's true. Supposedly like right there, right? Yeah. That's where they do it. And it's as small as a right. Would you rice. let me do it to you? No. <laughs> I would rather do it to myself. Well, oh, gosh. without anesthesia. I am not surprised. <laughs> with my eyes closed. <laughs> Rachel, thanks. Why don't you trust me? Larry, what's that one thing we need to know in weather? <laughs>